What's up, everybody? It's Big Roth TV, and I'm back with another sneaker video. A long overdue sneaker video because I've actually been sitting on this box for like a week and a half, maybe two weeks, if that, maybe longer. I can't remember when these came out, but I might have had them for about two weeks now. Just never got around to doing the review on these because I picked up a good amount of other shoes. So let's go ahead and get into them, man. This is a model that I do not own. So this is a new one for me. Let's go ahead and get into it. Nike box. As you can see, that white striped Nike tape. All right. So get that. Uh-oh. Don't throw that box away because the box is hiding the receipt for all you receipt boys out there all right so actually that was the second receipt this is the official this is the official receipt for all you receipt boys out there all right so here it is boom oh uh oh boom The Air 270, all right, there. Oh, very nice touch in the box. Very nice touch. You got all kinds of Air Max going around. Uh, Air Max 360, Total Air, Air Max, Nike Air, Air Max 180, Max Air, Zoom Air, Zoom Air, all the, the different Air Max logos i don't know how good my camera is at picking it up but going across the top of the box you have a bunch of different air max logos there on the side here you got your air 270 and then on the back you got your nike logo there and these are the air max 270 all right size 14 of course and uh, the colorway is black, white, dusty cactus on these boys. All right. So let's go ahead and get into them, man. These were the ones that when I saw this model of shoe coming out, I saw this colorway. I said, that's going to be the one I'll go after right there. I got to have them. Got to have them. But. You all know how I do it right here on Big Rob TV. Yes, sir. Left shoe first, baby. Yes, sir. Man, these boys right here, these boys right here are very, very clean. Very clean. But they remind me of another shoe now that i have them in hand and i'm looking at them the big bubble here on the bottom the big just the way that that looks and then looking at the bottom how that goes around like that they remind me of another shoe in my collection L let me let me grab those one second all right so these the way that this shoe is shaped Reminds me a lot of these, the Tubular X, the Adidas Tubular X. This is the original Tubular X with that prime knit. This is a very dope colorway. Let me take some light off of these boys. These were a very dope colorway, man. Turned heads back in OKC walking the mall with these boys on. But look at that bottom. You see how that bottom kind of caves in like that? It's rounded around there on the, the bottom and it's kind of caved in like that. Look at, look at that. It's very similar. It's very similar how that design is. Man, I just, I just thought about it when I was looking at them. And then also you got your, you got your, these are the Adidas tubular radial right here some of the most comfortable pairs of shoes that i have 
you saw in my last video, you saw that these are kind of that same colorway, that light mint, kind of that teal. But look at the bottoms. Look at the bottom. Very similar, man. Very similar bottoms right there. But I just thought these kind of looked like that. Something I wanted to point out. Maybe you all, maybe you all hadn't thought about that and hadn't seen these. But anyway, you got your teal uh, Nike check there. Another one here. Then you got your Air 270 there in the back. Nice pool, teal pool tab with your Air 270 on the back there and the Nike check here. Uh, big giant air bubble here, which is the highlight of the show. These, from my understanding, are not intended to be uh, running shoes. These are not intended to be running shoes. These are actual lifestyle sneakers that you can just wear around casually. So I definitely dig that. That's right. I ordered these. These were the Air Max Day release. That's right. So 326 Air Max Day these came out on Air Max Day. That's when I copped these. You got your Air on the back. So 326 on the, on the inside, Air Max. As you can see, we try to get that out. 326, and it says Air Max on the inside there. Um, size tag, of course, on the back. And then Air 270 on the tongue, which is Nike check up at the top. Um, very nice, man. Max on the front right there. Very nice. 270. 270 right there. It's funny to me. I keep saying 270. That's the area code where I grew up, you know what I'm saying, in, in Kentucky. The 270 right there, man. That's my area code. That's where I grew up. My stateside phone number begins with that area code, man. So, Air Max. It says on the bottom, Air Max, boom, right across here. So, very nice, man. Let's go ahead and get these boys on feet. All right. Here they are on feet. Pretty comfortable, man. Pretty comfortable. On feet. Very dope, man. I would, uh, let me see, let me, uh, let me see, my toe is about here, so it's like right before you get to the black area there in the front, but that's where my toe is, so that's, that's good, I would not, I would not get a 13 and a half in these, I would definitely stick with my 14, so, yeah. That's half size up for me, but I would either say go true to size or half size up, depending on how you like your foot, how you like your fit, I should say. Let me look at that bottom. Boom. Bottom. Boom. How I felt when I was looking at these is that I was going to be like really elevated higher in the back due to that. That air unit, I felt like I was going to be higher up. And while you can feel a little bit of it, it's not something that feels terrible. It just feels like it's a little bit of extra support on your heels. A little bit of that booty view right there. Get some of that booty view. Man. Man. Very dope, man. These were well worth the wait. I was very selective about the 270s that I would get. And these, man, these are right on time, man. These are good to go. These are good to go, man. Get you some of these for sure. But anyway, that's going to do it. Definitely, definitely, definitely a dope sneaker, man. Definitely a dope sneaker. Well worth the price I paid for them. Um, 
More content is on the way. Thank you all for watching, man. Get you some of these. I don't even know if you can get you some of these, man, because they're gone from Nike.com. But if a restock comes up of this particular colorway, get you some of these, man. Did they even, I don't know if they sold in stores. Did these sell in the stores? Did these sell in Foot Lockers or Champs or whatever? Y'all let me know in the comments. I, I don't know. I had to order them, but I'm glad that I was able to get them. They sold out like right after I hit the button. So it was it was crazy. I actually didn't think I was getting them, but they uh they actually made it here, man. I'm glad. So thank you all for watching. I, I do want to... Like, I'm curious because this is nice and soft already, this material, like this mesh material here. I'll put the inserts back in there. But this mesh material on the front is nice and soft anyway, but they do have a fly knit version of this same shoe. And I'm curious how that feels, like how much better the fly knit, because usually the fly knit versions of shoes feel a lot better on feet. They're a lot softer, but this is already kind of soft. So I'm, I'm curious. I might... I don't know. I might try it out. We'll see. Thanks for watching again. I appreciate your support. More content is on the way. And I'll highlight you on the next video. Peace.